Taurus, welcome to my channel. So in today's video, I'll be looking at your and your person's energies towards each other, how they see you, how they see the relationship, the obstacles in the relationship and their next step and the probable outcome of the situation. Okay, so this is going to be a general reading. It may or may not resonate with all of you. Take what resonates and leave the rest. So let's see what's going on for my Taurus and their person 24, from 24th till 30th of January 2022, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus sign. So let's see what's coming up for my Taurus and their person, please. Taurus and their person. Taurus and their persons, what's going on? Let's see. Okay, and if you want to book a personal reading with me, you can go to my Instagram page by the name The Magical Aura. The link is given in the description box below. So you can DM me over there if you want. Okay. So what's up here? What's up? Hmm. All right. So how do they see you? They see you as the five of cups over here. Okay. So I feel that uh, Taurus that somewhere they really feel that, you know, some they see you as a person who is either you are the one who is uh, really at a situation where you know you have lost all the hopes and somewhere you are more towards the negativity but um, they literally see you as a person who cries a lot and who is still in the past somewhere they feel that you are not ready to give them that love and that satisfaction which they leave which they need in a relationship and that's why they really feel that you are not the one whom they deserve but still they really have strong feelings for you um, although whatever happened between both of you or about your past, they really feel that it's you and um, this, they have that feeling, that strong feelings towards you. Somewhere I feel that they also, they also, they are also the ones who might have reg regrets in regards with something of the past situation. If you have dealt with this person in the past, um, this person came back towards you because of whatever happened in the past and yeah five of wands energy we have with the five of cups yeah the things were not finished they were you know two fives over there things were not finished things were like uh, this was an unfinished business with your person and now somewhere you feel that you know like not you they feel that you they really, you both need to finish whatever there was in between both of them and that's why they came back so this is an ex coming back to your life if okay uh how you see them you see them as a magician you see them as a trickster but i, I don't know but i really felt that this is a person you could be dealing with a gemini over here tell me more about the magician hmm. knight of cups yeah, you definitely feel that this person really knows how to talk because of the Gemini and Knight of Cups energy could be a Pisces or a Scorpio could be dealing with. So um, you feel that this person is uh, really, you know, coming up with different uh, excuses and they're coming back. They know how to uh, talk to you. They really know how to grasp your attention towards them. And um, that's why they're really good talkers. All right. So and that's why you are really in that place where you know you should whether you should give this person up one more chance or not i think that there could be a third party situation because of which they regret about it and they have come back in your life again to 
ask a sorry karma is back so they could have gone through some some kind of karmic imbalances like something might have happened with them as well which they did to you so yeah taurus i'm seeing some kind of a karmic imbalances which they have met hmm okay so how they see the relationship is the page of pentacles they see that this is a relationship which involves a lot of work and investment they know that whatever they have done wrong in the relationship in the past now they cannot do anything wrong they really need to work again see the ace of pentacles energy with the page of pentacles so they think that it's not the same business it's not the same taurus with whom i really um, you know invested so much of time and uh, now whatever happened i messed it up and i'm coming back to my taurus but i really need to work a lot it's not the same taurus whom i actually left in the past so yeah they really see that uh, it's not you it's not you the same person with whom they were dealing with and they know that i have to take it on board in a very new way okay all right how you see the relationship as the three of pentacles you also feel somewhere you really want to you know, collaborate or somewhere you want you know that a, a lot of efforts need to be given to this relationship again because once the trust is lost it's really hard for you to gain back three of pentacles along with the i'm getting a lot of pentacles energy which is you taurus over here which is taking who is taking time to um you know see how things should go with the same person if you are dealing with a new person in the situation for those i'm really sorry for the horns these are really noisy people you know sorry okay where were i okay so i was saying that two of pentacles with the three of pentacles you are a taurus who is a sorry a person if you are dealing with an ex over here okay so this person knows that you are uh, really taking your own time and if you are dealing with a new person over here taurus so that also means that you are taking time with a new person also because you have seen a lot in the past and uh, you do not want to just jump into any conclusions and you are taking time and you are giving your efforts and energies to this relationship new relationship if it is happening okay so uh, yeah you are really kind of juggling over there in the situation in this relationship you are not the one who is uh, seeing that that you know it's not just a relationship it's not a fling kind of a thing i have to if if we really need to work on this situation we have to be like it it has to be like equal give and take okay with the three of pentacles i feel that a lot of uh, teamwork is involved in the situation it's not going to be really easy for either of you and um, you are kind of juggling in the situation or in the decision making still all right uh, how the uh, what do they feel the re the obstacle is the obstacle is the queen of wands in their case somewhere they know that you know they could have dealt with a leo over there or you could be dealing with a leo but i feel that if the, if you have a, a third party situation so they really have dealt with a leo uh, person could be a fire sign could be anyone so it doesn't has to be a leo only um tell me more about the queen of wands yeah definitely three of with i don't know but this deck with the three uh, sorry with the sun it it makes me feel like this is a three party situation third party although everyone is happy in the sun energy but with this deck i really see that the sun is a third party like three people are really happy with each other so yeah like that kind of a thing is happening okay so um yeah with the queen of wands and the sun energy both are leo energy strong leo coming up in the uh, reading today so the obstacle they feel is that the third person was who came in between both of you and somewhere they are attracted they got attracted towards a third person if they didn't deal dealt with uh, sorry if they didn't deal with a third person actually uh, like physically involved so they they was somebody in their mind and they really feel that they did it wrong and somewhere that was not done right to you you know that is what they feel somewhere and they feel that this is the obstacle which is stopping my taurus to come towards me whatever they did wrong obstacle you feel in the relationship is the hangman you feel that this person 
uh, came at a position where you know your relationship was going so beautifully good and all of a sudden this person really came up towards you as a hangman personality things which happened the karma the karma which came towards you the decision making which happened before it really made your life a lot worse before and then after when you understood that what is happening you finally gained up that energy and you started moving forward and then this person is back again so that's why you feel that you know this is not a person this is an obstacle now towards your growth in life that is what you feel their next step towards the situation is the lovers they are not going to let it go so easily again gemini's energy so you could be dealing with a gemini taurus but this person definitely feels that you know they really want to give it a new chance a new try in this relationship yeah king of pentacles taurus see this is like the person you have always wanted to be with you this they are becoming like that person they are becoming like a strong taurus king of pentacles energy with the uh, with the gemini so it could be a gemini um taurus gemini cusp over here but uh, yeah this person is like now i am stable i am really confident about you please come back to me i really want to take this relationship to the next level if you will give me one more chance i would definitely would want to go towards that new level of our relationship so it's all up to you Taurus, like whether you want to give this person a new chance or not okay actions on your end is the three of swords i think it's really hard for you to forgive this person and to forget whatever happened between both of you the empress emperor sorry so yeah you uh, i feel that you have controlled your mind and emotions and you are not going with the flow kind of a person whatever is there in your head you are taking decisions from your head rather than your heart your heart is really not in a very good position but yes your mind is really trying to tell give you some signals that uh, somewhere this is not the person or something like that and you are really in control of your mind and your heart and you know what you are doing so a decision will be taken by you i feel the ball is in your court so whatever you feel is going to happen or whatever you feel that you will do you are definitely going to take your own decision you should definitely do that only taurus okay do not listen to anyone over here a uh, probable outcome of the situation is the 8 of wands i feel that whatever decision you are going to take up is going to be really fast and yes the decision will be perfect okay whatever decision you take with the star energy and you will be really having that that little smile in the face you know see how beautifully the star person is smiling in the face on on her face you know that there is a smile on her face and it's really pretty so yeah this decision is uh, really giving you a lot of healings and strong hope in the near future so definitely whatever the outcome is coming up it's beneficial for you taurus okay so just the hint over here is take decision from your mind not from your heart all right so um i think that's all from my side and um, okay so i hope that helps so we will meet you in the next video till then bye bye